Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how to upload a document to Blackboard to submit an assignment for your instructor for grading and for commenting. First thing you would need to do is use a word processor to construct or create your assignment. That way you can use the spell check and grammar check built into the software to make sure you're turning in a high quality product. If you're using Word, as in this example, you can save it as a DOC or DOCX version, uh, depending on the version of Word you're using. It could also be saved as a PDF. If you're using an Apple product or Google Docs, you will first need to download or save as to get it in the right format before going into Blackboard. So I'll demonstrate for you what, to you what it looks like in Google Docs. You go to the File menu and then Download As. You would then need to either choose the Microsoft Word, the DOCX version, or the PDF. Using an Apple product, it would be much the sim similar steps. You just want to save it as a, a PDF file before you move into the Blackboard course to do the upload. So in your course, the icon with the pencil and the ruler and the piece of paper means it's an assignment which should be attached or uploaded. You would click on the title of the assignment. You'll read through and review the expectations for the assignment. Make sure you've met everything required there. Do not use the right submission method, but use the attach files and browse your computer for your PDF or DOC or DOCX file. In this case, I'm just going to pick a Word document. It shows under the attached files section, but that is not complete yet. It is not submitted. It's just staged and ready to be uploaded. Some assignments will ask you to check this extra box for safe assign. You could also add a comment to your instructor in this box here. Most of the time you do not need to add a comment. And then you will go ahead to do the submit. If you reach this point and you want, want to go back and check it one more time, you could save this as a draft, go back and verify one more thing before hitting submit. In most cases, you would just hit submit. What you'll notice on the next screen is you want to verify that it's uploaded correctly. So in this case, I have a green bar at the top that says, yes, it worked. I see in the right hand side here that my file name shows up. And I see in the middle a preview in the box of the document that I submitted so I can make sure that it's correct. What it's doing in the background here is it's checking safe assign to see if I've uh, illegally, improperly copied too much information from other people's sites. So they'll get a, be a percent score that shows up there in a few minutes. Don't panic. It's quite often you'll get an eight or a 10% match score just because you're using some common phrases. Or if you've even included a citation, you might get a safe assign match score. So if it's somewhere in the 10% range, you don't need to panic. You'll just have to work with your instructor at that point. So that means that assignment's ready to go. If I find there's something I need to change, I could do the start new button. Otherwise I can just say, okay, and I'm confident that my assignment's submitted.